My favorite part about this job is interacting with the public. I'm very approachable as a chief, and, and I love that about this. So I, it, I think that's my, my funnest part of my job. My favorite part actually is playing with the kids. I mean, I love playing with the third, fourth grader, fifth graders. Like, they love me. I'm like a hero to them. I love that, and I love the fact that I can be that role model for these kids. I feel like it's really rewarding. I feel like being able to help people um, get emergency help to them is a super big thing to me um, to be able to do and know how to do. It's small but it's big at the same time um, so I kind of do get the same see the same people every morning um, heading into work or heading out like leaving in the evening. I do love the fact that it's not too big but it's big enough for things to you know happen. You get to know everybody really easily um, if you have people that you talk to all the time or they come in you uh, get to know them pretty well so I like the small town environment. About three years ago uh, I actually went on a call here in Coweta where we went to a house of a veteran, which I didn't know at the time, uh, where it looked like he was going to try and hurt himself. Uh, we went into the, the residence, I made contact with them. Uh, we ended up helping him and getting him down to a VA center. And then shortly after that, he walked into my office with his mother and he, he handed me a plaque which is hanging on the wall behind me. Uh, and he said that I actually saved his life. And because of what we did, he's actually going out to other veterans now and paying it forward. He actually goes out and fixes their cars for free um, because he felt like we did him a favor, so he owed the, the citizens of Coweta a favor. So that was a very, very big thing to me, and I, it meant a lot to me. So at a football game, a kid actually ran away from his grandma. Um, I uh, actually found the kid at the football game. I chatted with him and he was just upset that uh, his grandma wouldn't buy him a mouthpiece for his football game. So uh, that next day I went and bought him a mouthpiece and, and had his mom bring him to the police station and gave him that mouthpiece and he actually he almost cried. It was, it was a good experience and now when I see him um, he's more of an advocate for me being in the schools than anyone else is. As your chief of police it's an honor to be your chief. Um, I find it great that, that I'm here, that I've been accepted into the city. I'm not a hometown boy from, from Coweta, but you've accepted me and I appreciate that. Um, and, I, and I just love working in the city. I love where we're headed. I love where the city's going. And I'm definitely excited to be a part of the growth and, and the new challenges that lie before us.